Hey guys, this is my daughter Alice. Hello. And Alice is going to help me out today because we're super busy in the office and she's going to try and do some reasonably, I guess, advanced tasks um, with uh, our software Plusback. And Alice, what are you going to explain? Um, what a recipe is. A recipe. A recipe. Now, Alice knows how to make cakes and it's pretty much similar to what it is in uh, BIM software like Plus Design Build. So Alice is going to make some videos. It'll be interesting to get your feedback. How do you think you'll go, Alice? Oh, all right. Yeah, good. All right, well, first go. Let's give it a go. Bye. Okay, so we're going to get Alice to do some drawing here. You see, Alice, can you draw, put a roof on there for me? Mm-hmm. Okay, good. Yep. Righto. So we now have a roof. Uh, and if we did a takeoff from that roof, yep, take it off. Um, now, go to roofing. Yep. Oh, there's a lot of recipes already there, and I think a lot of other programs, you have to actually do all this stuff manually. We don't have to do that in plus Autonomous. Big. Yeah. Automatic. Autonomous, that's a good word. Hey. Okay, let's add some recipes just to see, show people what uh, recipes are. So, with the, the roof, um, if you just click on 21 roof on the left there, Alice, that's mm -hmm. it. That's actually showing you everything that's already been in there, and some of these things are, are already... Um, in there, so I can, I've already added a, a recipe for supply roofing screws for timber battens. Mm -hmm. So let's go to edit, see more, and have a look at that. Okay, so corrugated fixings, I'd say would be up there at the left. Yep, okay. So you can see I've got supply roof screws for timber battens. Now, in this instance, in that particular area where I created that, um, those screws was a low wind area, so I only needed seven screws mm -hmm. per square meter but we might be building another home in a high wind area. So mm -hmm. we can duplicate this recipe. So let's go duplicate, okay. okay? And what we might do is just before it says supply roofing, mm -hmm. we might just say high wind area. I'll do that, high wind area, okay? Right, and we got, we still wanna link it to the square meters, so just show where, show everyone where the link is. Link here. Okay, that's the link, yep, click it again. Okay, right, and you'll notice at the moment it's it's uh, linked to the square meters of the sheet. When we go and we'll kind of have a quick look at flooring in a minute and we'll, we'll show something else there, but whether it be roofing screws or you know anything that we want to associate with the square area of the roof, mm -hmm. we would link it like that. Um, and we can do the same thing with capping and so on. Yeah. Um, we could also assign a recipe for labor. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah, how would you do that? Okay, so same, so if you notice in the bottom it says associate labor tasks. Associate labor tasks. Yep. There. Oh, yeah, thank yep. You. Okay, and go add new. Add new. Yep. Okay, now scroll down. Okay, you'll see you've got a new recipe starting up here. And we might say uh, install roof. That's Costco, so you don't want to go there. That's it. Right. Uh, Costco, we'll talk about in a minute. So basically, with uh, a high wind area, we're going to. Roof is going to put in more screws, so he's probably going to get, want to get paid more, right? Mm -hmm. So therefore, we're going to say, okay, um, maybe we we'll just call it install extra screws, screws for high wind area. Right? Up. That's what he's going to do. Okay, and basically, uh, we can link that item again. So if you go link, link. yep. Okay, scroll up. Okay, yep, and link it to the square meters. There we go. Yep. Right uh, and go down and go save changes. Save changes. Yep. Uh, would you like to pay him for other things? You, we can, basically what that means is that you can, it, you've probably got 20 or 30 different colors of roof and so on. You can link it with that. But I'm gonna say no for the moment because I think people can, will get the hang of that. But we also, we mm. wanna add who it is. So if you click on search vendor there, mm. we can type in who it is. So if I type in R, Double O. Okay, you can see we've got a roof carpenter there, yeah. um, or Jay's Roofing, whoever's going to do it. On the left, on the cost codes, if we click on that, and we search it, we can type in roof. Right, you can see that we have a cost code there. Mm -hmm. And cost codes, you probably don't know what they are, but we'll talk about those later. But essentially, a cost code can be how you would order the job, or you know the way you might run your book work and so on. So, yep, click on roof. Yep, roofer. 435 roofer. 435. That's the one, yep, okay, and that's it. Basically, you've now created a purchase order for the roofer and you've actually created a recipe for the amount of screws and that's pretty good. How old are you, Alice? 13. 
13. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Maybe. Would you have to rewrite that recipe if you were to do it again? No, it'll remember forever. Forever? Ever, ever. Wow. Yep. That's pretty good. Yeah. Um, let's let's quickly have a look at the floor, and because it, as, so, let's just close that estimate down. Go no. Nope. Okay. Let's click on the floor and go right click, take off selection. Selection. Yep. And we're going to go to framing because our flooring is under framing. Framing. Yep. And go to flooring. See there. Flooring. Yep. Edit. See more. Oh, yeah. Yep. That's it. Yep. Okay. So you can see there that we've actually got a, a sheet that is thirty six hundred by eight hundred, mm -hmm. right? Which is the size of the sheet. And we've actually gone in here, and I'm just gonna grab that mouse for a second, is inside of here, we've actually added things about it. And I could change the type of flooring I wanted. So we might say, we're gonna actually order this as, you know, 3,600 by 900 flooring, right? And therefore I'd need to know how many square meters are there in each sheet of flooring. Mm -hmm. So I'd wanna bring up a bit of a calculator there. Let's see if I can get one up. So therefore it would be 3.6, well I might actually go here, yeah, 3.6 times 0.9 equals the 3.24 square meters per item. All right, 3.24 square meters per item. And the price uh, for the item, let's just say we pay 50 bucks. Sound fair? Yeah, I guess so. Right. And we're gonna select it and go save and select. Do you want to save this selection for other models? If that means that basically next time I draw, do I want it to be 36 by, I say no, but you can say yes if you want to override mm. all your other stuff. Right, so therefore, uh, in the floor that I've drawn there, this is how many square meters uh, I have, and therefore I have six sheets of flooring. Okay. Nice. Yeah, that's kind of handy. Mm -hmm. However, we want to associate screws per sheet of flooring. Right, so you'd need to go and add a recipe. Can you add a recipe for me? Add a recipe. Uh, add new, yep. Mm -hmm. Right, you're gonna to have to scroll down to the very bottom. It's always the bottom one, okay? Yep, mm -hmm. and we're gonna write in here uh, eight G screws for 36 by nine by nine flooring. Right, and we could write anything about gal, whatever, whatever. Anyway, so you're gonna need, let's say per sheet of flooring, we're gonna need 25, so yep. I'm gonna need 25 sh screws. Right in screws next, move it over. Screws. Yep, per one and then sheet of flooring. So instead of organizing or associating the recipe per square meter, we're actually gonna associate it per sheet. Yep, so link it, go up and click on number six. That's how many sheets of flooring we got. Okay, and go save changes. Save changes. That's it. Would you like to associate with similar items? We're gonna say no, but it could be yes. Right, okay, you can also go and put in a price there. So where are your flooring screws? Yep, uh, no, it's where it's orange. No, that's it, yeah, price, right. Okay, so because you've clicked in that box there, you actually gotta click out of it to tell it that we don't wanna work in there, right? Okay. So we're gonna go here and go, well, we're gonna pay a dollar a screw or whatever it might be, right? Therefore, it's $150, they're expensive screws. Mm -hmm. So whether you associate a recipe by per square meter or per each item or per cubic or per cubic foot or whatever it is, basically, you know, you can bake your cake as long as you know the recipe. And once you got the recipe, Plus Design Build has remembered it and we're away. Beauty. Mm -hmm. Oh, how do you think that went, Alice? Do you think yes. you're gonna be a, a trainer? Mm, see how it goes. <laughs> yeah, why not? Give it a crack. Yeah. All right, guys. I hope it helps out. Look, if you like the video, uh, push like. If you dislike the video, push dislike, but make sure you tell us why. And if you want to see more of Alice's training and you thought it was helpful, let us know. All right, cheers, guys. Bye. All right, stop her up. You can click Alt R.